I've always loved sports. As a short, slow white guy, I'm not a serious player, but I really enjoy shooting hoops. My buddy Ben always used to tell me not to force the shot, but until recently I never truly understood the real meaning of nothing but net. Head back in the game. Okay? All right, all right. Man. Shoot it, Adam. Shoot it. Nothing but that. Woo! Yeah, baby. Yeah. Good game. That's game us. Good game, fellas. But it's time to clean the court. It's time for aerobics. Amy is the best thing that ever happened to me. But it took me a while to figure that out. Uh, thanks. Are you hanging out for a bit? Um, no, I gotta head out. Okay, well, I'll, I'll see you later. <sighs> Bye. Little did I know, my girlfriend Carol and I weren't shooting at the same hoop. Adam's taking me home to meet his parents this weekend. Really? Sounds like it's getting pretty serious. I don't know. Uh, I'm meeting him a little later tonight. You guys have been spending a lot of time together lately. Yeah, Adam's so sweet. You know, I really like being with him. I just don't think I'm ready to get serious with anybody. Seems like a pretty nice guy. I don't like some of the other losers you dated. Well, his friend Ben's kind of cute, don't you think? <laughs> You're so bad. <laughs> I was set to toss up an air ball and didn't even know it. No problem, I just got here a couple minutes ago. Um, I wanted to uh, talk to you about something. Me too. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hey, I'm George Stacy. Hey, guys, what's going on tonight? Um, nothing. Could we have maybe catch up with you guys a little later? Sure. Come on, honey. Let them have some time alone. Put something wrong? You um, seem tense. I wanted to make it a special for our anniversary. Um, this is where we had our first date. You know, our, our first date was six months ago today. Was it really? <laughs> that's, that's so sweet. But he's not afraid of commitment. I was thinking um, maybe we should take our relationship to the next level. Adam. Well, I mean, we make a really good team together, don't you think? Yeah, we have a good time together, but... I'm ready to make a real commitment. Adam, I really like you a lot. I just don't think I'm ready to get married. I didn't think that we were that serious. I mean, we have a good time together, you know? Donna, her mom and dad have been having problems. Um, I have to take this. I'll be right back. Is this what I think it is? Have you asked her yet? What? Um, no. Uh, we're just having coffee and talking. It's I'm going to get us some coffee. Actually. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, you know I'm sorry. You know, you two make such a nice couple, oh. and John had told me that you were going to. Oh, well. Um, look, I'm, I'm really sorry something's come up. I can't make it this weekend. Wait, wait, you can't go. Not until we talk this through. I have to go. I love you. I'm just not in love with you. Can you accept that? I thought by proposing I was doing what I was supposed to do, being responsible, getting serious. But I was forcing the shot with plenty of time on the shot clock. So everything okay? Yeah. Sure, Doc.
couple days later, I caught up with Kyle to see if anything had changed. In my heart, I know now that Carol wasn't lying when she said she cared about me. She was just scared at the thought of commitment. I was Mr. Right now, not her Mr. Right. But at the time, I felt like the world had collapsed. Wrong girl, wrong time, wrong place. Amy wasn't hey, giving up on me. Sharp out there. Hey, thanks. Hey, um, if you were heading out for a drink later tonight, you care to come out? Nothing but Nepra. I was forcing the shot, messing myself up, trying to make other people happy by doing the right thing. It wasn't until I stopped trying so hard and listen to my heart that my shot fell in without my even thinking. Relax and trust your instincts. The right girl is out there for you, maybe right under your nose. Future now. 